another interesting topic here now before i begin the topic let us look into this imagine there's a initial point and the terminal point in the number line you want to find another point say the coordinates of this point but you don't know where is this coordinate you know the initial and the final point but you know the fractional distance say this is about you know one fourth of the total distance so if you know this fractional distance then you can find the length uh, from the initial point by using this formula x1 is the initial point this value plus the fractional distance that is one fourth or if you want say 40 percent that would be four by ten and so on this is this will be given x2 is the final point minus the initial point again let us quickly solve a couple of problems now say over here you have been given the number line the initial point x1 is 2 and over here there is x2 and the fractional distance are mentioned so let us do this one over here say 7 by 16 is given the fractional distance is given all you need to do is initially start with x1 i'll write it like the values 2 plus the fractional distance 7 by 16 multiplied by x2 19 minus 2 and this would be the answers all you need to do is put it in the calculator so over here it's 2 plus 7 by 16 multiply it with 19 minus 2 19 over here is mentioned as the final point and over here 2 is mentioned as the initial point and you will get 9.4375 so that would be the answer same way you can try the others and check the answers over here now let's do a problem from the right side over here here now find the coordinates of a point g it's not mentioned that is g point is uh, the fractional distance is given that is 2 by 3rd of the distance from b to d they are mentioned b and d b is the initial point over here that's minus 5 d is 1 all you do is same thing over here let's say minus 5 plus fractional distance is 2 by 3rd multiply it with x2 is given as 1 minus of minus it becomes plus but i'll just write it in brackets this is it the answer would be minus 1 and similarly solve the rest and check your answers very straightforward if you know the formula